Hey, hi guys, uh, welcome to PCF. Uh, this is the continuation of, uh, you know, data warehouse concepts uh, tutorial. So in this video, we are going to discuss about the role playing dimension. What is role playing dimension? So what is the behavior of role playing dimension? So uh, that we are going to discuss now. So here I have taken the examples for the day team. Okay, dim date table and then fact internet sales table. So in the fact internet sales table, so date key, so one date key, okay. So the date key is connected with the multiple times within the fact table, okay, different with the different keys. Date key connected with the multiple keys in a fact table, okay. One only one date, okay. So now if you mouse over, so so if you mouse over, like see, so which one it's it's connected with the date key as a due and connected with the due date key. And then so the same date key, okay, same date key and connected with the see so the same date key connected with the order date key also okay here i let it okay same date key also connected with the order date key also and then well, again same date key connected with the ship date key also okay so same date key again connected with the ship date key also okay so means one date table one date table is connecting to the multi uh, date key one date key is connecting to the multiple date keys in a fact table means date key is only one but it's playing multiple roles okay it's playing multiple roles like you can take uh, you know any heroes okay they hero is one only but they will play multiple roles like a uh, triple role or double role so that is called role playing right so the same way so date date is having only date keys having only one time but it's connecting multiple uh, keys in another table so that is called a role playing dimension hope you understand this guys okay hope you understand date is only once but it's creating a multiple it's playing multiple roles that is the reason this, this is called a multiplying date is a best example for the role playing dimension but the problem is here so when we connect like so so the first uh, first one is active relationship so when user ask okay when user ask mm, like so i want to uh, due date amount the ship date amount say order date amount so like due date amount we can get perfectly but when we when user ask about the you no know, order amount and then shift amount so we may not get the direct results okay for that what you have to do uh, we have to create a uh, two more uh, tables uh, two more tables like this okay so you can create a um, dim dim date separately and uh, order date separately and then shift date separately so the, then you can get the perfect results but the thing is, if you go with the total table, okay, so for single relationship, if you go with the entire date table, that again, you know, uh, big mess, like, so it will take more memory, okay. So data warehouse, like, so go with the, you know, uh, less amount of memory, that would be better. So even you can create a view instead of, you know, in, in, uh, uh, in SQL side, you can create a view with the only one column of date key and then you can connect that would be a better or else okay in in it's a power bi okay if you are not belongs to power bi so limit it but if you are belongs to power bi so we have a use relationship function to make inactive relationship to active okay so this way we can create and then uh, we can use the uh, so this is called a role playing dimension guys hope you understand role playing dimension means okay only one date table is is playing multiple roles that is called a role playing dimension okay so that is about the role playing dimension hope you understand here is the date is the role playing dimension the same way like uh, in movies how the heroes will uh, play multiple roles that's called a uh, role playing so same way here the date table is playing multiple roles that is a called this is a role playing dimension hope you understand so uh, i have given simple examples guys okay so if you like the video uh, please you know share and subscribe my channel um, to more videos case okay more videos like this okay yep thank you guys thank you have a great day